Hello everyone, it's Pierre and welcome back to the channel. I recently got a new fish called the Marble Gobi, or Oxy Eleotris marmorata. It's considered to be the largest gobi in the world and can grow up to two feet in length. They are native to fresh and brackish waters of Southeast Asia in the Indo-Pacific region. As you may have guessed, they are considered a delicacy and are also farmed for human consumption. Marble gobies are tropical fish and are tolerant of various water conditions and salinities. Temperature range is 72 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit. They can be adapted to live in a pH of 6.5 to 7.8. They do best with low nitrates, but again can survive in very poor conditions. Marble gobies are called sleepers as they tend to stay on the bottom when they mature and wait for prey to swim by even burrowing into the sand. They also have the ability to change colors and camouflage to some degree. This probably helps them avoid detection while stalking their prey and also avoid being eaten while young. As you can see, my goby is fairly active, which is not unusual when they are younger. As nocturnal ambush predators, marble gobies are carnivorous by nature. This means that they will eat any fish small and slow enough to be caught. I've had to feed mine live shrimp and chopped worms as it doesn't seem to like pellets very much. They are territorial and aggressive, especially with their own kind, and so plan on keeping only one specimen per tank. That being said, tank mates can be any non-aggressive fish that is big enough and fast enough not to be eaten. Although, like I've said, it's best kept in a solo tank of its own. It's also important to move this fish to a larger tank as it grows, eventually needing an aquarium of at least a 48 by 24 inch footprint. Right now, my marble goby is in a 20 gallon tank of its own, but will eventually be moved to a 150 gallon tank in the future. As you've seen, the marble goby is an unusual and hardy fish with peculiar traits and behaviors. If you can get your hands on one and have the ability to house it long term, you will be rewarded with a unique, beautiful, and interesting fish. As always, thanks for watching and happy fish keeping.